All right, so what's the deal with the $500? Brittany, what, what the heck, $500? Does it have my name on it? It just might. There, again, are parents who um, did not receive their $500 they were supposed to receive, their $500 stimulus checks per child dependent uh, under the CARES Act. And quite frankly, um, they are going to be given more time to actually apply to get this $500. Now, I know you're thinking, well, Brittany, don't they know that I that I have um, dependents? Don't they know that they owe me money? Yeah, they do, but they, they might not know that they owe you that $500, which is why you need to apply. If you missed out on that additional $500 payment under the CARES Act, um, again, they're going to be giving you more time to apply to get it. You've had to, if you did not get that payment, you've had to apply to receive it. Um, that time was initially pretty short, but they have uh, extended the time that you get. If you are a parent who is on Social Security or if you receive uh, Supplemental Security Income, SSI, you will actually register to receive that um, $500 by using the um, IRS's non-filer tool. Um, I have a link to that in the description box. And again, that's for people who receive parents rather with child dependents who receive social security or supplemental uh, security income. But here's the deal. You have to do this by September 30th. So you have a little bit more than a month if you fall into that category to register to get that $500. Again, that link is below in the description box. Um, now that said, parents should be getting this money by mid October. So do it by the end of September, by October 15th ish, you should see the check either in the mail or that deposit in the bank. Now, if you haven't been required to file a tax return, um, and you still haven't gotten your, your, your checks, here's what you need to do. 